this is yet another area where consensus is um, difficult. The arguments are not um, water tight and different reasonable people may come away with different understandings, but I th think it still makes sense to um, enter into conversation, to try to understand the other's arguments, to try to assess the evidence um, for um, different uh, faiths, and I think um, progress can be made in that regard. The claim that to suggest one particular religion is right and the other is not, the claim that that's uh, arrogant, I think, is to misunderstand the nature of truth. Truth claims by their nature, I think, are um, exclusive. If something is um, right, is true, the opposite is, is not. And so I think there are competing truth claims um, across different religions. They can't all be um, correct, but I think the result is not to simply step away from these questions or um, to suggest we should only talk about what we can achieve consensus on, it's to engage, to identify those areas where there are disagreements and to assess the evidence um, as best we can. So I think it is important to be respectful for, of those with um, other beliefs from other um, faiths and to acknowledge that they have a similar point of view with respect to truth as one does oneself, that they believe that their own views are, are true. N neither is, is arrogant. Both are trying to come to an understanding of truth, and I think the best way to go about that is to enter serious conversation, university context, or, or elsewhere to try to identify um, what the evidence is for different positions. Thank you.